Okay, so in this problem, we're going to prove that whenever we have two injective functions, their composition is also an injection. So proof. So before we prove this, I'm just going to go down over here in the side and write down the definition of injective again. So recall it means that for all x, y in the domain, uh, f of x equals f of y implies that x equals y. So that's that's the, the definition of injective. Whenever the outputs are the same, the inputs must also be the same. So we'll start by supposing that f o g of a is equal to f o g of b for some arbitrary little a, little b inside capital A. Now, f o g of a, that means f of g of a by definition of composition. Likewise, f o g of b means f of g of b by definition of composition. Now, here we have f of g of a equal to f of g of b, but f is an injection. Therefore, little g of a is equal to little g of b. And this step here is because f is injective. It's one of the key steps. In the next step, we have little g of a equal to little g of b. Therefore, little a is equal to little b. And this step here is because g is injective. Since little a and little b in capital A were arbitrary, this holds for all little a, little b inside capital A. Therefore, f o g is an injection. And that's how you prove that whenever you have two injective functions, the composition is also an injection.